Posterity will appreciate all your sacrifices President Muhammadu Buhari on Friday in Abuja said the long-suffering, commitment and sacrifices of all his supporters over the years will be remembered by posterity, urging them to remain steadfast in pursuing the overall good of the nation receiving the governance support group at the presidential villa. President Buhari said he remains eternally grateful for all the personal and collective sacrifices that culminated in winning the 2015 elections, assuring them that all the efforts would never be forgotten I can never forget your sacrifices and I am grateful for all. You never gave up when things were bleak, and we needed to survive. I can't express my gratitude enough in spite of the environment you found yourself. You kept believing and pushing. Some of you were really exposed to risks. My consolation is that you voluntarily threw in your lot with me. Some of you exposed yourself so much, and I knew it. I urge you to still stick to your principled ways of doing things and our country will be the better for it, he said. The president said the administration had ushered in a new era of accountability and responsibility by auditing and correcting the many wrongs of the past that crippled the economy and created an exclusive class, promising to consolidate on the reforms he had initiated for change in the country. Some of the things I saw here were unbelievable. I still shudder and wonder how a country can survive under such abuses. It is only by an act of God that we survived, he added President Buhari told his supporters that he was not oblivious of the personal risks and investments that brought in the government, citing the appointment of Mr. Boss Mustafa as secretary to the government of the federation as most deserved because of his steadfastness I want you to maintain your steadfastness. We have gone through the worst of the times. We lost elections three times and I learned a lot along the way, he said according to him, after losing in three elections and pursuing cases up to the Supreme Court, he learned that ethnicity and religion had no place in Nigerian politics, but personal interests prevailed the chairman of the governance support group, Honorable Shakwumika Wajuba commended the president for the bold initiatives in restoring security, tackling corruption, and setting the economy on a more predictable path. Wajuba said the group would continue to support and advise the president on areas that needed more attention, which include engagement with party members and supporters, empowerment of Nigerians and the fight against kidnapping.